the Local 3 Facebook forecast is sponsored by Gromax. Hello, I'm meteorologist Tom Kippen. Welcome to our Local 3 Facebook forecast. Another round of snow today that dropped anywhere from 3 to 4 inches to as much as 6 to 8 inches in some spots. We're going to get rid of the snow tonight. We'll still have some snow in spots, but it will turn very cold. Tomorrow, we're going to have an Arctic cold front cross on through. Not going to have much snow with it, but it's going to kick up the wind and we'll have bitter cold temperatures. And once again, that snow is going to blow around. But with the bitter cold combined with the windy conditions, that's going to produce dangerous wind chills. It's going to be bitter cold on Friday. We'll have a bitter cold start on Saturday morning and then slow improvement in temperatures as we head into Saturday afternoon. So the round of snow that came through here on, two, on Wednesday afternoon, that'll move out. We'll have some lake effect snow showers in spots for tonight. And then as we head into Thursday, we're going to have an Arctic cold front. This is the Arctic cold front. Not much snow to work with here, but this will swing on through, kick up the lake effect snow and kick up the winds as we head into Thursday night. And then we'll have some light lake effect snow showers for Friday. As for temperatures for tonight, we'll have low temperatures in the single digits, teens near the Lake Superior shoreline, below zero readings west of Marquette, and then as we head into tomorrow, we'll have high temperatures in the teens, and then watch what happens as we end the Thursday night. Temperatures really crash. We have low temperatures anywhere ranging from 10 to 20 below for inland areas west of Marquette to as warm or relatively warm as the single digits near Lake Superior. And then on Friday, we're looking at a very cold day. As for wind gusts, look at the winds pick up as we head into Thursday evening. Wind gusts along the Lake Superior shoreline could be 40 to 50 45 miles per hour and then the winds will start to lighten up a little bit as we end the Friday morning and then the winds will be light as we head into Friday afternoon and that produces some dangerous wind chills to strong winds. Wind chills tomorrow morning will be at or below zero and then watch what happens to wind chills as we head into Friday morning. Wind chills as low as 25 to 30 below zero closer to the Wisconsin border. Elsewhere we should have wind chills anywhere from 10 to 25 below zero and then we'll have wind chill readings improving as we head into Friday afternoon. So a quick look at your three day forecast here. A small chance of some snow on Thursday. Lake effect snow on Thursday night. Bitter cold Friday morning and Saturday morning, but it's slow improvement in the temperatures. Thanks for logging on to our WJMN Local 3 Facebook page.